All right, let's go E4. Actually, let me refresh the refresh it. Okay, he's going to play the French. I'm going to play the ortho schnapps here. Let's go queen B3. Oh, he refuses. So I guess I have to play kind of a somewhat decent opening now. Let's take. Go queen D2, knight C3. What's wrong? What, what is Tours on? What do you mean? You guys can see the board? What are you talking about? Tours is good. Is there something wrong? I'm only 9679 wins away from, from 10,000. Yes, you guys. The ortho schnapp gambit, I think, is actually somewhat sound. Although, I think I'm going to get hammered in this game. This guy seems very serious. No nonsense. I get the double ops, though. I get the two ops. Go 92 here. Maybe it's not so bad. The H file is a pixel off. Oh, sorry. Okay, I'll adjust it. Apologies, you guys. There you go. All right. Let's take with the bishop here. The camera is a tad off center, too. The camera is fine, you guys. But, but I'll adjust the camera, too, just so you guys. Just, just for you guys. Just for you guys. There you go. Okay. Are you happy, you guys? Wait, what's going on? One second. Wait, what just happened? Of course, now I'm going to lose this game, you guys. I think that's good. This castle. Young man. Play an end game. Mm, not thrilled by this, but it's playable. Y M C A. Is this dude really gonna force a draw? Oh no, he's not. Okay, he's gonna play. Luckily, I don't think he knows who I am. That helps, or else he would have forced a draw there. I think you had time cycles for the prime thing, a world of pain for the six of fearless bird of, Parad bird of paradise for the nine. Let's go here. Y M C A. I should have gone here too. Uh, let's go here, I guess, in bishop c3. I don't know what I'm doing this game. I am young man. Okay, let's go a4, a5 here. Gotta fix the weaknesses. Okay, let's 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 try to win this game. Okay, let's go here. I, ah, I blundered. Oh yeah, 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 blunder, but he missed it. Okay, let's go here. Hit bishop c2. I'm gonna win this game though, you guys. I am c8. If here, I'm gonna go rook c1. What's that? Wait a second. I have to be very careful how I do this. I feel like I should be winning here. Let's go here to touch the bishop. And now I can go rookie one, maybe. If I activate my rooks, I'm going to win the game. I have rookie six now. I mean... Let's go here. I have rookie five, maybe. I also have rookie six, I realized. Uh, I'm trying to win somehow. I just go here and here. Did I just throw this somehow? I think I did. Let's go here. Can you throw a rook c3 or something? Okay, I guess let's take and take. I'm going to try to flag him for sure here. If I had more time, I could, but I can't do it. Oh, and that's a blunder, too. Okay. Wait, but now he just threw this back. Okay, now I might win this game. In fact, I think I am winning now. So I can check. Did 
Did I have a mate in one? I didn't think I did. I'm gonna flag him here. This is a speed run, no mercy. No mercy, you guys. No mercy. In a normal game here, I would give a draw because he's more than 15 seconds, but in a speed run, there's no there's no mercy. Oops, and that's why there's no mercy. You got one up. He wants a rematch. Let's give him a rematch. He's very un unsure of who I am. Okay, what can we play? We can play the Benoni or the Benko. Let's play the Benko. Let's play the Benko Gambit. I'm gonna do this one okay. I guess takes his D6 is always okay. I mean, 97 is fine. I think you can just also develop his castles. I think this is supposed to be fine. He's unaware. Yeah, he's definitely unaware of who I am. What was the trick? Uh, I tried to play the Ortho Schnapp. I couldn't really get a trick off because he didn't let me. But the goal was to play the Ortho Schnapp. That was the whole point. Go here, target the pawn. I have Queen A5, Knight C7. And this all looks very happy times for me. This guy is a solid Russian Andy. He doesn't accept gambits. Yeah, I mean, that's more or less true. There are no kids anymore to do to, to do the do the tricks. Yeah, I mean everyone's so booked up in chess openings that you don't really ever get that anymore. That is a good point. <clears throat> Excuse me, you guys. Nack Manson is your favorite gambit. I mean, that's a playable gambit. Yeah, this is a good position. I'm just up a juicer here. He's, he's now all in. He's like desperation mode. Um, I mean, I think I can even just take the pawn. Why not? I love my materials. What am I eating? I was eating a croissant. A croissant with um ham and ham and ham and fromage. I can play rook b2 here. I have knight f5 also. I mean, I also have queen b. I mean, there's so many moves here. Bishop d4, knight e5 is one idea. Honestly, I don't know why this isn't just good. Because takes, I just take with the bishop. Takes king h8. I can eat the juicer. Let's eat the juicer. I can eat all the juicers. I can take on c3. I can take on b2. Let's just... um. What's the way to win this? Rook B2 looks correct. Let's just take. Oh, I just threw. Wait, did I just hang? Wait, Rook F7? Wait, no, I take it. I have Knight E8. Never mind. I'm insane, you guys. I thought he'd Rook takes F7, Rook F7, and Rook E8 mate, but I just take with the Knight. I'm just mentally losing losing my marbles now. Let's take with the Queen here. Croissant avec jambon et fromage. Yeah, yes. Jambon, exactly. It's still not easy to win, but I should be much better. Let's go here and remove the knight from d6. This guy d4 only, you can play Le Budapest next. I think he is only d4, if I'm not mistaken. We're up, we're up three pawns, though, so it should be pretty cleanly winning. Go here, I can just take with a pawn. I've got knight f5, knight h5. Everything is falling apart. Let's just go here, knight f5 next move, and it's all, all curtains for my opponent. Good accent right there. Yeah, jambone. The jam bone, exactly. How did I beat Magnus and Primus was a stage? Uh, you're so gullible, my friend. It's the internet. Anything is possible on the internet. Let's go check. 
target the knight rook c3 bishop i mean this is all just pretty cleanly winning it's just a matter of go here and here i guess force the rooks off and pretty simple we got the dub let's keep rolling two up oh he wants to play again i didn't mean to do this okay this will be the last game against this guy play the ortho schnapps he's refusing he's refusing to play d5 i mean i guess that's that's a bad sign for a french player is that a strong gm like rustinov is unwilling to go into the gambit line it's a bad sign very bad sign let's do this I think Magnus had this against uh this year very something very similar to this maybe it was a knight c3 bishop b4 included already in their world championship but Magnus had something very similar to this go f4 let's go here in bishop f3 I guess I mean I really like my position I have to say I mean I don't know if it's like winning or anything but it looks very happy times Okay, I can obviously check. I don't really want to. I can also go 94, but let's just play an end game. In honor of the of uh, of Magnus, let's let's just play this. I guess let's just go here. Go here, maybe rook d1. Okay, I guess I'll go rook d1 now. Let's go 94. I'm looking at 96. I'm also looking at maybe a double double. Yeah, let's go for the double double here. F6, I take knight of 6, knight g5. Looks good. Okay, it goes knight f8. I personally don't like knight f8. I feel like it's just getting way too passive here. Okay, I guess I'm gonna play h4. Just launch, launch everything here on the king side. Just fling it all. Goes g6. Not another move that I don't like at all. Um, I'm gonna go like here maybe looking to play h5 next move just b5 i can obviously take i can also go h5 here just gamble the pawn but i think i should probably consolidate here on the queen side let's just go here uh he's got knight a4 i guess but i have rook c1 not wonderful but it's still okay goes to h5 i can obviously trade if i want to if I'm trying to win the game, I should definitely trade and try to put pressure. I have knight g5 lurking as well. Okay, it does take. So let's go here, touch the pawn. Knight b6, knight d2. My knight's well placed. I have rook h7. I don't think he's going to be able to hold up here because f7 is weak now. I've got f5, knight d2 back. Okay, let's go here. It goes bishop d8. Lo very logical move, actually, which I completely overlooked. Uh, let's go here. Let's go here. Touch the pawn again. Now I have to be careful because now there's knight d6 lurking as well. Bishop b4. Now I have knight d6. I also have knight g5. I think knight d6 is the right move. Just further reinforce everything here. He's got f6, rook h6. Or rookie seven. Or bishop h4. I think. I think this is the right one though. Take. Everything is kind of guarded here. E6 is weak. I can put my bishop here. Very hard to play for black, I think. Thank you to Military Muskrat for the Prime. Thank you so much to Military Muskrat. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Can I do a title Tuesday tricks? Um, very tough. Go here, cut the check. I still take the juicer next move. Wow, he's still streaming. Yes, you guys, of course I'm streaming. I've said it before. Like, if you can't put in five to six hours every single day, um, I'm not sure it's a profession that you're meant for. Let's take the pawn. I guess I'll check and go here and take the pawn. This must be winning. With the king cut off here, this has to be just winning. King's running up. Uh, I mean, everything is just... 
think this just wins. I have rookie five. 